Here we go. This one is absolutely sizzling and a beautiful opportunity, truthfully, for both sides. I mean, when you look at Hanato Moicano, this is a guy who's gotten chance after chance, right? I mean, he was this close to beating T-City Brian Ortega, if not for just a late fight of the night finish by T-City. And then the UFC went and gave him Calvin Cater, Jose Aldo, Korean Zombie, most recently Rafael Fazeev. And, you know, they've given him a lot of opportunities. And in this one, it seems like they're sort of taking it a step back, giving him a fight that he, in truth, you know, based on how the UFC likely perceives the skill set of Moicano, he should probably win because he's going up against uh, Jai Herber, who the Black Country banger, who is 10-2, and two, and in his last fight, he was just absolutely stiffened. Uh, it, it was almost as if he was mystified, like some sort of trance, but like not via the magic of a Tim McGraw concert, but rather the overhand meat bombs of a 40-year-old Maso Ron Dubu. So Trinaldo absolutely just stiffened Jai Herbert. Uh, the infamous Dan Hardy stopped the fight, and it was a fight where Herb Dean, you know, stood over, stood doing his thing uh, over the unconscious human, waiting for someone to jump in, but forgetting he was the one entrusted with that responsibility. So it was pretty heavy, and this is no layup in a return versus Hanato Moicano. He was supposed to fight uh, against Drakkar close, but that fight got canceled, and I think that would have been a more winnable fight, truthfully, for Jai Herbert, because... Hinato Moicano, I think, is coming in this one hungry. I mean, I've always shilled for this guy ever since that T-City fight when he was just so close to taking out Brian Ortega, and he was just so slick all around in that matchup. So I'm always bullish on Moicano. That's where I'm going. But how do you see this one playing out between uh, the Black Country banger, Jai Herbert, and Hinato Moicano? Yeah, this is a, this is a very interesting fight because, like you said, this should be an absolute lock for Moicano. Um, the... the 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 levels that he's already fought is just beyond on what you know the black country banger uh you know brings to the table uh you know his ufc debut lost they're giving him one more shot it's like yo if he can get through this savage you can stick around but i see this i see him absolutely just getting knocked out dismantled just destroyed like his last fight i think he's got to go back to you know whatever organization cf he was at before and uh, get a few wins and, you know, get his bearings in. Because I don't know if he's ready for the big leagues. Uh, kind of how it showed his last fight. They kind of try to set him up for, you know, banger with an older guy. Proved him wrong that he's not ready for the UFC caliber fighters. And Moicano is no joke. Uh, so I've got to go with Moicano with this one. And uh, I'm guessing some mission second round. Yeah, I really feel you on that. And we did see Jai Herbert have some success in Cage Warriors, right? He, you know, he was finishing a lot of guys. He, his stand-up game was looking pretty nice. But as you put it, I mean, this is the big leagues. This is the, the highest level of competition. And uh, it's killer after killer. So I'm, I'm with you 100%. I like Hanato Moicano in this one. I think this is his opportunity to rebound. And if we look over at Tapology, 79% is rolling with us. Uh, they're picking Moicano. Majority of it is copper. They think that submission is imminent. So I'm with you. I'm with the majority uh, of Tapology. I like the Moicano submission in this one. I think he's going to find a way to get this thing to the mat. And uh, from that point, it should be easy work. I'm hopeful that Moicano just, you know, rediscovers that sauce and really puts everything together. I hope he strings his uh, his striking with his grappling and and just really offers his complete skill set. Because when he does, he, he can fight with the best of them. So when he puts it all together, uh, I think it's going to be this weekend against Jai Herbert. So any last thoughts on this uh, Hanato Moicano Black Country banger banger? No, this is an absolute bang of the bang. Um, very fun fight. Uh, excited to see Morikano get back on his feet, get back in that winning area. Um, you know, he's already fought all the best, uh, you know, a lot of them. And uh, I would like to see him get that spark back and uh, back up there with those top contenders than these uh, one-pump chump bums. Uh, so hopefully this does it for him. Stay tuned, boys. Check out other videos. Make sure to subscribe. Throw a comment. Who you got? You got the one-chump bum or you got Morikano? Uh, respond to all comments. Love hearing from you guys and uh, check out the other videos.